Uh, you two can't, probably. Yeah. Well, like, I assume that, but I wouldn't be surprised to see more fucking Mario Ditto, so. Or Diddy vs. Mario or some shit. Nah, uh, old Brad might take the Diddy out if if he's a couple of, if he like loses ish kind of hard but we'll see I really don't want to play Josh again to be honest yeah I mean just win yeah thanks man if you just win six games like you don't I have really to play him anymore that's how yeah, it goes I just want you know I'd rather just like lose to these days <laughs> than play six games against Joshua Francis at least yeah, minimum six. Yeah, that's, that, that's, that, that's the rough thing about that. Interesting down air in neutral. Like, it worked. It's good. I just wouldn't have expected it. Alright, yeah. Mewtwo's dash attack is a very good move, which is like, oh, you, you whip something over there, I'm going to just hit you for it. Yeah, that sounds about right. Here we go. He's just kind of staying just out of... Oh, no, that's a good idea. Yeah, good just, turnaround fair. He's kind of just staying just out of, like, the Mewtwo's, like, grab range. Because it's not very good. So you, yeah. can, you can just sort of punish it super hard. Oh, that was nice. wonder if that was a read or if he was just like, I'm going to retreat after this. Yeah, I'm not too sure. I'm not sure. Oh, he goes no, for a cancel. Yeah, he doesn't yeah. quite get it. Okay. I'm led to believe that is actually difficult with... You too? Too, yeah. yeah, it's pretty hard. Because he kind of like... He doesn't cancel if he bounces. He kind of does like the slide. And he's, oh, he, he doesn't yeah, yeah. cancel after the slide either. Like you kind of have to like almost nail it. Yep. Thing. You gotta do it first time. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah I guess with Smash for the uh, it's pretty difficult. Whereas yeah. other stages you can get like specific setups for it. Yeah, I think Battlefield's pretty... It's not too bad. Yeah, you kind of just go to the right spot and press up B. Yeah, yeah exactly. I should really learn them in 64. <laughs> They're so good. You top platform, up B cancel with big shifts. Oof. Yeah, that just, that just sounds like it's busted. Yeah, it's so good. You just come <laughs> back from everywhere. Yeah, it's yeah. just like, oh, sick, I get to leave. Oof, 26. Oh, continuing. He had a big lead, and all of a sudden he gets hit by, like, one fair and a shadow ball. And oh, yeah, Mewtwo's again. damage output is ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. He didn't... Oh, nice. Okay, oh, he probably could have fed again then. Not worth the risk, I don't think. Probably not. And he's, yeah, he was just like, I'll get the Shadow Ball, I'll have neutral. Yeah, I guess that's better. Yeah, good dash check. Knew he was in lag. Oh, okay, oh. I don't know about that back air, that was probably not safe. Good wave from Lewis. Yeah, yeah it's calling out the air dodges. Well, like, Mewtwo's gonna air dodge. His air dodge is so good. It is. Like, but he's hitting the Edge Read as well, which is good. Which is, can be hard against Mewtwo sometimes. Yeah, but having a big sword helps. Yeah, true. Off oh, fair? Ooh, you don't want to be getting hit by those in yeah. the So this is where it's scary for Spears. Yeah, he always does the like jump to like jump cancel Shadow Ball, depending on the ledge. And so it's it, real good. It is good. It's like, know my timing or stay dead. Yeah, that's it. Oh, okay. I don't think it wants to like, fall off stage there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, dodge. Okay. Gets away with this. Oh, okay. I wonder if Mewtwo down air could, like, be. Oh, yeah, like character stuff. Maybe. I don't know. Karin's hard to, like, get that on there. Just because the up Yeah, the up is so big, but. Yeah, exactly. You have to, like, sweet spot it. Yeah. Survival. Mewtwo's the sort of character where it might be, like, best to, like, air dodge through up air or some dumbass shit. Yeah, yeah. Like rising fifth or, or something. Something like that. Yeah, you like, can, like getting into that position before they grab ledges. Yeah, yeah. Nightmare, so yeah. I think that's the good thing about Mewtwo. It's like you can kind of like sort of just go your combos on the go and most of the things seem to string together pretty well. All right. Not a bad field. Yeah. Kill throws will ki kill later. Interesting side beat. Hits the shield and it forces him onto the platform. Probably very beneficial. I wonder if that's like a setup he normally goes for or what the hell that was. Oh, down there hits through the ledge. I dropped him. I didn't know that. Yeah, those. Maybe. It, it's a tall character thing. I was about to say that it probably is like a current thing because he's kind so tall. It's not, it wouldn't be current specific, but yeah. Well, just a tall character thing, but that's why it worked there. Yeah, it loses Sammy's already. Yeah, because 
It's one of those things that if you know it's going to happen, you can just duck under it. Yeah, that's it. It's, yeah. But I guess you kind of wouldn't expect a Mewtwo to like land. Yeah, down. Mewtwo in particular is yeah. just like, ah, oh, yeah, that's a thing. And okay. it's kind of like, yeah, Mewtwo just sits there after eight, like ages. Oh, okay. Yeah. Whereas if you see a Falcon player, you know they're down there in oh, the yeah, every it's single fucking yeah. time. <laughs> Yep. And you can just crouch it and like up smash and be like, yeah, okay. Yeah, you can. That was a nice shadow ball there. Yeah. Shadow ball? No, it doesn't look good now, yeah. yeah. Oh, I like, he yeah. was ready for it, but the down edge. I'd like to see Brad like try to create some shadow ball setups. Yeah. Like, you know, try to cover an option with something and then throw the Shadow Ball instead of just going for... Well, they're near the ledge, it'll kill. Yeah, he does. He, he, he kind of uses his Shadow Ball more as, like, a raw kill option than, like, yeah. anything afterwards. Like, he doesn't really follow off stage with a yeah. Shadow Ball, which can be really scary sometimes. But I think Fair at the Ledge might kill soon. Helps. I mean... Oh, that that'll cool. definitely kill. That'll do it. Oh, that's nice. Uh, doesn't quite get the, the heart that he wants out of the, the second fair. Yeah. I guess he should have gone for like drag down there. He probably knows better than I. Do. Yeah, I think it's so. It's one of those things where, you know, you combo a character, you're like, oh, they'll go this high there. This amount of floaty, but yeah. Yeah, that was a good, good, good nair after that. Yeah, yeah. S situations like that, if he had a Shadow Ball, he could just throw it at the platform and nine times out of ten. It, Hit him with it, so. Yeah, yeah. yeah Shadow Ball the ledge. As, a ball to, as opposed to that, where I was just like, you know, throw it away. Oh, the back air? It's only in forward? Okay. Yeah. Right, yeah, you can't, yeah. Challenge that one. Yeah, Lewis looking for oh, the immediate the kill. Very quickly approaching, Mewtwo can grab you and kill you percent. I think he's living that one though. Too. Yeah. Why would he go to the ledge? Oh, okay, yeah. I think Karin's pretty yeah, safe on the ledge. They have, like, she has solid pretty, ledge, yeah, yeah. She has safe options to like get away pretty well. But yeah, oh, so yeah, 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 yeah that's it. definitely going to do it. Yeah. That was good. Good for right. Yeah. He seemed that, for the most part, he had that game pretty well under control. Yeah, he kind of just took a small lead and yeah, the whole yeah. game. He probably led him, let Spewis back, oh, Dizzy back in a little bit more than what he wanted to, but... It's still good, though. Alright, now where do we go? Town? Town, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's, a, that's a pretty good... Pretty good for both characters, really. Yeah. And uh, Mewtwo up throw is going to start killing it like a hundred with rage. Yeah. So. <laughs> oh, just the roll past and uh, yeah. the sound boost. Yep, nice sound boost. Nah, yep. Solid stuff. Yeah, at least in that sort of situation, you can kind of force a power shield with the neutral Yeah, yeah. If you hit the like ledge ones, it's like, if they don't get hit, you don't get anything for it. Yeah, that's Particularly it. if you're throwing them high, it's like, if you go low, at least you, like, you know, force them into the air. You can kind of shark with fair. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh, I guess it wasn't kill percent, so he's just taking the damage. Yeah, probably next time. With the pummel. Yeah, he's definitely looking for it. Oh. Yeah. See, and that's the power of Shadow Ball, is that like, it whittles down your shield so much yeah. if you do shield it. I think when he does hit, like, when they don't get power shield. Oh, that was a grab. Oh, dash attack Ooh, will kill anyway. Never mind. You just think of dash attack instead. Yeah, the eye was a bit off there, but it's okay. But, um, yeah, when Probably I see... mashing or something. <laughs> yeah, maybe. I'm not sure. Oh, so we probably could have... Yeah. That's as good. He's just little, yeah, easing his way in, getting a, getting a Get, slow. Yeah, he's getting lead, the yeah. big damage in real quick. Oh, okay, that was nice. Other thing I would, wouldn't mind seeing like, Brad do is go for the like drag down nair sort of stuff. Yeah. Particularly off stage against a character like Corrin, if the if it trades with the up they probably die. 
I don't know if it would trade though, but it would be, it'd be worth at least trying just to sort of see what happens. And then you'll know for next time. Because yeah. it'll be fairly safe. I mean, it's a rare situation when current goes super low like that where they have to double jump then up B to get yeah, back yeah, exactly. vertically. But in that sort of spot, having a move that could... Okay, Nair kills. <laughs> yeah, Nair... I mean... It, it looked like it didn't kill by a little bit either. Oh! The, the non-tech saved him. <laughs> Uh, but yeah. Right, yeah, yeah, catches the roll, yeah. Throw him low. Because that's, that's where you want to throw him. If you're going to be doing the Shadow Balls on stage, you throw him low. If they do jump from the ledge or wait, you know. Yeah, you just follow the option. Cover the, the other option with... Oh. Yeah, because it covers everything aside from... Well, it, it can, it, jump it, and then depending, yeah. depending on invincibility, um, stay on ledge. Yeah. I mean, you can catch jump every time the roll, but FD though. Yeah. I think this is good. This is probably better for Khan. Oh, okay. Oh, he punished it? Wow. Yeah. Okay. Looked like he knew it was happening, so... He did run up and, like, power shield it, so I guess that's pretty good. Yeah. Oh, that was a punish, but he just sort of... Bit, bit, like, a bit late on the net. That's good. Oh, good roll behind, but... How's he going to get out of this corner is the real question. No, that'll do it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> down tilt. <laughs> Just land in front of down tilt, that's easy. He, he could probably like put more pressure on when he gets to like Lewis's shield a bit lower. Because he kind of just like stays yeah. back a bit. I don't mind the counters from Lewis, but you got to like know when they can punish and when they can't. Yeah, Khan's counter is super hard to punish though. Well, like even if the punish is they approach True. Yeah. Lose out that way. Oh, you wanted for a counter. Yeah, you can. It's, it definitely seems to like this is part of what what he wants to do this game is just counter the shadow ball a lot. Yeah. Like it's it makes sense. Yeah. It's easier than shielding it. And it's more if if you know your opponent's gonna throw a whole lot of them, you don't really want to be taking the shield damage. So unless you're power shielding them, yeah. You it. want some other way to mitigate the damage. Yeah. And because Shadow Ball's so funky and moves up and down and whatnot, you can't really afford to jump over them or something. Yeah, it's very risky. You just want to kind of stay apart. You just want to leave them alone, basically. Yeah. That would have been a situation to throw the Shadow Ball. Is yeah. It's Corrin pins, Shadow Ball. Oh, it's fair and that's fine. Yeah. But yeah. Oh, okay. Didn't really punish the roll in, but that's fine. Actually, that is a very good height to be shadow balling at. Yeah. Where it, like, covers jump a little bit. Maybe that's what he's been going for this whole time. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah. Lewis hasn't hit with a pin in a while. There we go. Well, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what he needs to do more. Counter some, but power shield the rest. Yeah. They're just sort of running up and shielding. Yeah, that's that was the best option. Like, <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. I know Lewis is normally pretty good at like if he like if you do do that a lot, he'll just like grab. Yeah, he's really good at reacting to that, but he just sort of hasn't really been catching it too much. Fair. I don't know, just goes away. Doesn't want to overextend too much. Alright, so that's ball. What do do? Good power shield on the pin, yeah. He wanted to counter knock it. Uh, yeah, ledge up counter is not a great option. No. Ooh, big combo though. Oh, Quick 40. Extend? No, Edo just passed the pin. A bit, bit slow on the, the, the non charge. Yeah. I don't even know what that move's called, but. You know, the Dragon Fang or that, whatever it is, yeah. yeah. Dragon Rush or whatever it's called, yeah. Oh, he just rolls again. Okay. Yeah, kick away. Yeah, just get a shadow ball, man. That's yeah. What need. Yeah, that's it. It's like you've got. Oh, ooh, yeah. That pin coming in clutch. Oh, okay. That was. Is that it? Probably. Yeah, yeah that's it. Right. Good luck, man. Okay.